this is my small stream water source uh, last night. That thing was flowing great. Filled my three liter Phenox bag in seconds. So awesome. Great flex camp. Oh, didn't even notice there's a little bench right over there. Hmm. So I was camped back over here. Last night, pulled into camp about 6.30. It was dark. So, yep, right there. Between that tree where my pack's sitting and that big one right there. That's where I had my hammock hung up. All right, this is, let me get the, uh, you know, we'll, we'll get that later. That was my camp spot for last night. All right, it is Saturday, October 28th, day 200 on the Appalachian Trail. Wow. Uh, sun's not up yet, but coming up quick. It's light. It's been light since about five after seven. Lighting up the hike anyway. It's about 7.30 right now. So I'm pretty much packed up, ready to go. Need to tighten my shoelaces. i take my jacket off, stuff it in the pack, and then we'll be on the trail. Um, it was nearly a full moon last night. It was clear skies, clear skies this morning. It was bright outside, so I'm glad I had my tarp so I could at least sleep. Uh, you can still hear some traffic from the interstate, but uh, it's far enough away and I'm protected down here in the little valley that I couldn't hear much, so I slept well last night. Uh, we'll make it into Pauling today. Not sure exactly what's gonna happen after that. Not a lot of lodging choices in Pauling. Uh, I'm going to check the forecast again and see if the rain is still on. Probably is. 90% chance of rain uh, yesterday anyway for uh, for tomorrow. So whether we'll try and zero in polling or just push on. I'm um, two days away from Connecticut. Uh, about 30 miles. And so we'll push on there. Uh, there's an outfitter in Kent, Connecticut. I'll get some uh, freeze-dried meals there they don't have any any source of that in Pauling I don't think uh, I need to stop in Pauling anyway at the CBS pharmacy to pick up my prescription that I ordered yesterday so uh, it's time to move on stay green keep growing day 200 been a long time on the trail In the absence of uh, any mosquito repellent, since it leaked out of my bottle, yeah. uh, I was going to show you what I had done with my bandana. So I got my tied around under my neck, tied down here, covers my ears, back of my neck, all those exposed areas, so it reduces the target size of the mosquitoes, which are still active here. That. Combined with my hat, my, uh, uh, it uh, gives me a relative amount of protection from mosquitoes. So, works. It works. I love my boonie hat. 